he's starting to become the enemy. This is where the Clippers have to defend without fouling going forward to give themselves a chance. Garland, Mitchell, Levert, corner three, air ball. They get the stop. How can they get the score? Paul George has been quiet in this fourth quarter. Pocket picked by Allen, 2.15 to play in the game. That's when your teammates have to help you out. They have to see that defender running from behind you and make you aware of the fact. Pick up the dribble, get rid of it quick. Garland down the lane off the window. Might have been blocked by man, recovered by Morris. Powell in attack mode, runs into his defender, a whistle and a foul, stops the clock and once again put Couple here. Point line, which is always a help. Lou was asked about what do you think about the small sample size of his first 10 games. He said just that. We are progressing. We're making some, some nice plays. We're trending in the right direction. Deflection. Interception by man with Garland to beat. Flushes it in with the right hand. Four-point game. 101 seconds to play. Timeout, Cavaliers. Secure the basketball. That means five blue jerseys on a defensive board to come up with the basketball and get it to miss. Stop would go a long way here. Mobley with five fouls. Hands to Garland. Nine to shoot. And the whistle will be free throws. There's a stop, a whistle, and a foul on Garland. And they will send Reggie to the line for two. Teams in the regular season. 15 points and six assists and a couple of massive free throws. And it is a one possession game with 123 to play. Two timeouts, Cleveland with one timeout remaining. Garland. Allen. Denied. Taken away by man. Powell to tie. Counted at a foul. who goes up strong and right there did Paul George get him across the arm that's what Coach Bickerstaff has been complaining to the official about turn the corner concentrate finish this could give them the lead it is short love with the rebound whistles on either side are free throws the crowd alive in downtown Los Angeles the NBA staggered the games all night long for moments just like this Garland shadowed by George. Creates space, fires a three. No, and the rebound jumps out of bounds, and the Clippers have it with 40 seconds to play. Paul George. George accelerates down the lane. Off the window. Hot damn! The Clippers take the lead. Counted at a foul. We were just talking. With 40 seconds on the clock, do you go quick to try and get a two-for-one, or do you just wait for the best shot and take it when it comes? Well, Ty Lue told him he wanted it to go quick, early. Paul George not only does it, but takes the blow. The Western Conference NBA Player of the Week puts a pending here. Three-point Clipper lead, timeout Cavaliers, 30. LeVert to inbound. No timeouts. Mitchell gets it. Poked away for a moment by George. Mitchell recovers. Dumps it to Mobley. Takes it to the rim for the flush. It's a one-point game with 29 seconds remaining. Jackson shouted by Garland the length of the floor. They do not have a timeout if they get the position on a missed shot. The whole timeout advancing. Morris is fouled with 15 seconds to play. The first with a timeout. Pair and the Clippers lead by three. Garland fouled by Jackson. And that'll put Garland at the line. Garland misses on the first of two. They'll foul you and the officials are going to let you get hit. Jackson trying to dodge the defense of Wade who reaches in and fouls Reggie Jackson this fourth quarter. And this game has not disappointed Reggie. And it's Mr. Jackson if you're in huge free throws here in the quarter. Mitchell deep three.
I don't know what I saw right there. Giving them an opportunity for a four-point play. Mitchell at the line for three free throws. Second free throw. Walking between raindrops. Mitchell. He missed that one on purpose. Rebound batted around. George gets it. And I believe a foul was called. But boy. I would really enjoy it if he just made both of these free throws. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You make this one, you might be looking for the foul this time. He missed it with no timeouts. Love. Oh my goodness. My heart was in my throat, but the Clippers hold on. It wasn't pretty down the stretch, but it was certainly a gritty win for the Clippers. 119, 117. The Clippers trail by 13 in the frame. They battle back and they snap an eight-game winning streak for the Cavaliers as the Clippers improve to six and five on the year.